The 100 Thank Yous project has been running over the course of the year. It has involved students from the Cove School, the Wavell School and the Sixth Form College Farnborough. The idea of the project was to get the young people to develop an understanding of the role of the Gurkhas played in the First World War and to then work with a series of artist tutors to develop creative responses to the research that they undertaken. And these creative responses would act as a form of commemoration to the Gurkhas' role in the First World War. It is very um, good to see that the young people are commemorating the First World War. I think commem commemorating the program like this would give them the opportunity to know about the Kirkus rule and what we have done in the past. Definitely my favourite part is um, learning more about the Gurkhas. I feel like I'm doing something out of this project because I can put my own work and try and put a message through it and through art. I didn't know how to do photography or anything. I never wanted to learn photography and I thought that also like using it to commemorate the Gurkhas was also a good way of um, using my art skills as well. The really good thing is like, I'm getting to learn new things every time. It's like I'm getting more like confident to use different things over time. Meeting the Gurkhas I think was the most interesting part for me because it's getting their history on it. They feel like they've gained a lot of respect, um, they've gained a lot of knowledge that they wouldn't have had otherwise, and they've got to meet people that they wouldn't necessarily meet in day-to-day -day life. Um, we've also had students of Nepali origin um, able to come in and, and kind of bridge the gap between the students here and the Nepali community, and actually it's been quite a, um, a growth opportunity for everybody involved. Meeting Royal Life Gurkhas was really interesting because they all have either personal stories or like personal opinions on what happened. Well, my family members were in the Gurkhas as well, so it felt like I was seeing another family member, but in a way, because their experiences were different, even though they're from the same sort of background, it was really nice to see someone else's perspective. Yeah, it makes me proud to be a Gurkha and uh, to share the uh, history and tradition of Gurkhas to the younger generation. I mean, it just makes me proud to interact with the uh, younger generation and the community. It is particularly important for us in the Rushmore area to value and appreciate the role of the Nepalese community, both past and present.